today we will see iot levels and deployment templates today we will going to see various levels of iot iot system comprises of following workings number 1 device resources controller service database web service analysis components and application so these are the various components of any of your iot system so every iot system will have some hardware devices it will have some resources it will have some services it will going to use we may use some database to store the data generated by various sensors and actuators those data can be stored in your what such local databases then we will have some web service if we are going to use some cloud like structure to store the data then we will be using web services for iot system then there will be some analysis component those analysis will be done on whatever data will be stored in your either database or it will be stored in your cloud the analysis will be done on such data by your iot system so iot system will have some analysis component and iot system will have some application which will be deployed over it so these are various what components out of which uh, due to which your iot system has been design so every iot system will have these components not all but some of the device some of the workings will be the part of your what iot system so we have gone through what exactly iot device is we saw iot devices resources various services database web service analysis component and applications of your iot system so these are what total six levels of iot level 1 to level 6 that we are going to see here level 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 six iot levels out of which this is the first iot level here you can see there are various components like this is iot device resources various services database will be there there will be some web services and there will be one application so this is what your components are workings of any of the iot system so iot system will going to have these components not necessarily all the components will be there but some of the components will be there in your iot system and there will be what one monitoring node that will going to store or monitor or it will going to have some analysis of data so this is what your iot level one in which you can see everything will be happening on local side there will be no use of cloud in case of your what level 1 so level 1 will be completely based on the iot application which will be deployed on local system it will not be part of your what cloud system so everything will be at local side a level 1 iot system has a single node that you can see here or device that performs sensing and or actuation stores data performs analysis and host the application so what exactly going on at level 1 at level 1 there will be one node or there will be one device what exactly that node or what exactly that device will going to do it will going to sense or actuation will be done by that particular node or that particular device then that particular device will going to store the data it will perform some analysis part and it will going to host the application at local level that's why it is your what level 1 which will be covering only local system it will not going to cover your cloud based system level 1 iot systems are suitable for modeling low cost and low complexity solution so always whenever you wish to implement low cost iot application or whenever you wish to implement low complex solution for the various problems then in that case you may use level 1 iot system which will be available locally on local system where the data involved is not big and the analysis requirement are not computationally intensive when you are going to use level 1 when there is not big data involved and there will not be the huge analysis of data in that case you may use what level 1 so usually remember when you wish to when you are going to use level 1 
when there will be no big data and then when there will be not much computation in case of your iot application this is when you are going to use iot level 1 this is iot level 2 here you can see that there will be two parts in case of your level 2 local and cloud based in case of local all your monitoring node devices resources and various services will be available on your local system whereas your database your web services and your application will be hosted on your cloud and this node will be going to connect with your what cloud storage for getting these services a level 2 iot system has a single node that performs sensing and actuation and local analysis now remember in case of your level 2 the local system will going to do sensing and it will going to do actuation and it will only perform local analysis it will not going to do the global analysis or it will not going to do the analysis on cloud side whatever analysis will be done all that analysis will be at this local side only and what it will going to do it will going to sense and it will going to actuate the data with the help of various sensors or actuators used in that particular application data is stored in the cloud and application is usually cloud based whatever data is generated by the sensors or actuators all those data will be stored in your what this particular cloud database and that cloud database will be responsible for doing analysis over cloud side it will not be your what local side and those iot application are usually your what cloud based applications level 2 iot system are suitable for the solutions where the data involved is big whenever there will be big data level 2 will be used so we can say that from level 2 onwards whenever there will be big data these systems from level 2 to 6 can be used so whenever there will be big, big data we will use iot level 2 here you can see that the cloud will going to store the data there will not be the storage on local system which will not going to affect the local storage internal storage of the local system all the data will be stored on your what cloud side that's why there will be no issue of your storing or storage capacity so this is what your iot level 2 where it will be have two parts local and cloud this is your level 3 in this level 3 again it will be from local and cloud side a level 3 iot system has single node like this data is stored and analyzed in the cloud and application is cloud based yes correct it is similar to your what level 2 in case of your level 3 data is stored and analyzed in the cloud and application is cloud based correct level 3 iot systems are suitable for solution where data involved is big and analysis requirements are computationally intensive so when this level 3 will going to use when there will be big data and when there will be the huge data computation there will be huge analysis of data computation and there will be huge big data storage as well as big data analysis in that case you are going to use level 3 iot systems this is your level 4 if you see the structure of your level 4 in the level 4 you can see there are devices resources and controller servers services then it will have the database on cloud side it will have some services over here there will be iot application there will be cloud but you can see there are multiple monitoring nodes over your iot level 4 and there will be observer node in case of your iot level 4 so there will be observer node there will be multiple monitoring nodes and rest of the structure will be same that means it will be at local as well as cloud side a level 4 iot system has multiple nodes that perform local analysis as we discuss there are multiple nodes in case of your iot level 4 and all those multiple nodes are responsible for doing what local analysis data is stored in the cloud and application is again what your cloud base it is similar to your level 3 that is data will be stored in the cloud and application will be your what 
cloud based application level 4 contains local and cloud based observer node so you can see here there will be one observer node at local side again there will be one observer node at your what cloud side what it will do it can subscribe to and receive information collected in the cloud from iot device whenever there will be various iot devices all those iot devices will going to generate some data it will going to generate some data and that generated data will be gen uh, received by those observer node and observer node will going to store that data on your what database so this is what the task of observer node is it can subscribe to and receive information collected in the cloud from the iot device whatever data is going to generate by the iot device either it can be the sensor data or it can be your actuation data whatever data is generated by the iot device all those data can be stored in the cloud by whom by this particular observer and that observer is present on local side as well as on cloud side level 4 iot systems are suitable for solution where multiple nodes are required if you wish to use multiple nodes in case of your any of the iot application then in that case you are going to use iot level 4 this is level 5 if you observe or if you see the difference between level 3 and level 4 sorry level 4 and level 5 you can see there will be one coordinator in between your node and cloud there will be one coordinator here present rest of the things are similar for iot level 5 like it will have some end point devices resources services will be there there will be observer at local side if we see the cloud side then there will be database there will be some web services there will be iot application and there will be observer node everything will be same like your level 4 only the difference in case of your level 4 and level 5 will be what level 5 will have one coordinator node whereas level 4 do not have any kind of coordinator node if you remember this diagram now we will see the description about this a level 5 iot system has multiple end nodes and one coordinator node that we already discussed it has multiple end nodes and one coordinator node all those end nodes will going to perform sensing as well as actu actuation task coordinator node will going to collect the data from the end node and it will going to send that particular data to the cloud so what coordinator will do coordinator node will going to generate all the data generated from your end nodes and that particular data will be collected by the coordinator and coordinator will going to send that particular generated data to the cloud storage or cloud database so coordinator node will going to collect the data from the end nodes and it will going to send that particular data to the cloud data is stored and analyzed in the cloud cloud and application is again cloud based yes all the data will going to store on the cloud and application will be your cloud based again the analysis will be done at cloud side also level 5 iot systems are suitable for solutions based on wireless sensor network so usually level 5 iot systems are used where you wish to use your what wireless sensor network in that case level 5 will be used in which the data involved is big in case of your wireless sensor usually the data involved is your big data and analysis requirements are computationally what intensive and there will be huge what data analysis that's why level 5 will be used if you wish to implement wireless sensor network based application in which data will be big and analysis will be computationally intensive this is what the level 5 iot system is and last one is your what last one is iot level 6 iot level 5 and 6 both are same in case of your level 5 there was centralized controller in case of your level 6 again there will be one centralized controller but there will be one additional centralized controller in between your what various 
controller and web services if you can see here there will be one centralized controller in between services also and there will be one centralized controller in between node and cloud also a level 6 iot system has multiple independent end nodes that perform sensing and or actuation and send data to the cloud so what exactly iot level will iot level 6 will have it will have multiple independent end nodes all the end nodes in case of your iot level 6 will be what they are independent nodes which will going to perform sensing and actuation part and it will going to send the generated data to the cloud data is stored in the cloud and application is again your what cloud based correct the analytics component analyzes the data and stores the result in the cloud database there will be one analytics component that analytics component will going to do data analysis and whatever will be the result of that particular analysis all that all those results will be stored on the cloud database this is the task of your what analytics component which will be the part of your iot level 6 the results are visualized with the cloud based application whatever will be the result generated here all those results can be seen through your what cloud based application the centralized controller is aware of the status of all the end nodes and sends the control command to the node what this particular centralized controller will do centralized controller will be aware about the status of each and every node whether all the nodes are working or not that will be monitored by the centralized controller and centralized controller will going to have the record of status of each and every end node and it will going to send some control commands to each and every node to check whether all those nodes are working fine or not this will be the task of your what centralized controller so centralized controller will going to check the status of every end node and it will going to send the commands controlling commands to each and every node to check whether each and every nodes are working properly whether they are working fine or not this is what the task of your centralized controller is thank you